Ian Miles Chong is more of a scumbag than Monday Matt, and we'll be going through some clips to show exactly why this is the case, as I don't think even Monday Matt would stoop to the level that this motherfucker currently is. So let's just jump right into the clips. Don't fuck, you don't have to fucking lie. We know you're lying. This is a fucking play. You're trying to act fucking dumb. We know you're a no, dumb fucking I'm, retard. I'm but like you're you're playing. Like, oh, no, I wish. Somebody Dude, I wish I was lying. I wish it was that you know. I wish it was that simple. I'll say, oh yeah, I was just making it up. I just wanted to dox somebody. No, 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 no. Yeah, you I did. Fucking played. No, you didn't get no, played. I got fucking played. Yeah, I got you're, fucking you're played. You're saying that uh, Goose doxed the, the gamer gate and stuff, and you're really upset about that. No, uh, no. Goose I, goes I, I, after I, people and the Gamergate <laughs> and the yeah, anti-Gamergate, and he's a bad guy. And we need to go after the only way we can stop Goose. That was go what. That was family. that was my. You know, yeah, what about the family? Part. That that's one part. Like <laughs> the family aspect. But gotta, his family doesn't know what he's doing. The family, family thing. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So all right. Let me explain. We gotta the cut their thing. heads off. So this clip is from about three months ago, and Zidane is the only one that actually properly calls out. Ian Miles Chung, as Jim is close-ish second and Gate is third, but really, what happened was Ian Miles Chung helped to get someone swatted and their dog died because a flashbang exploded right next to its head. I was showing more clips, but it wants you to fucking beat up a wall. So we'll just move on quickly as this is now three months into the future and fuck Ian Miles Chung. You like, are an I'm idiot. I'm telling you, it's not a conspiracy. You're an idiot. It's not a conspiracy. Yes, I'm an idiot. What do you want me to say? Like, I fucked up there. And But you want me to admit to something that's not true. You're saying that it I'm working true. with all these other fucking morons. How do you know that? How do you know it's because true? Because... Yeah, the screenshot. Up. We have because screenshots. We have Tonka like, talk in these fuckers. We have everything. Yes, you and Tonka talks almost. to them. Tonka works with them. I and do you not work with Tonka, you idiot. Invited. They never invited me to any of these. You ruthless, tartless bastard! <laughs> okay, I jumped the gun slightly as apparently Ian was working with Tonka like three months ago, has been doing it for these three months, and was feeding information to Tonka about Andy. He also worked with Andy and then quartering about different gaming projects in which, as you might know, Andy and the quartering don't really sort of get along too well. And basically he's just, as they say in this stream, a fucking whore for money. He will suck anyone's dick if it gets him one more penny. And this stream was so retarded. His original plan, the reason why he doxed the person that lost, obviously, their dog to a fucking flashbang was because he sent, he didn't even send it apparently, it was someone else, a message saying, oh, I've paid fucking three bitcoins or whatever to get someone to assassinate you. Just the most ludicrous shit you've ever heard. Even dumber than the bolder story from Monday Matt. Monday Matt should actually be stoked that emails Chung is just exploding before our very eyes, as it's just so malicious and he just doesn't give a shit whatsoever and it just gets worse as this video. i was gonna say it just seemed like it was his play right uh to come on he was getting shit on and to grovel and try to be like no i was the one getting played it, it wasn't my fault i was given this information i had to give it to somebody uh no you didn't you fucking <laughs> email strong has been a snake since day fucking one since day one he was this super left dude who jumped over to be right wing uh, just for just for money, basically. Uh, that's it. He'll write any... If you pay him a dollar, he'll write whatever the fuck you want him to do. He is just a whore for money. That's all he is. And I, again, I had my suspicions back then. I never liked Ian Miles Strong. I, I didn't like him from day one. I hated that guy. And I still hate him. And I knew there was going to be trouble when I saw him working with Worski on his gaming channel and then working with quartering on another gaming thing yeah i actually found a video from mundane matt of all people where he was it was nearly four years ago where he was like look maybe we shouldn't just take this guy that has been shit talking us slagging us lying about us for about nine months or so maybe we shouldn't just take his apology instantly i went like sargon and other people were like oh yeah let's forgive him mundane matt was actually like Oh, maybe we shouldn't be utter retards. So, 
I can't believe Matt actually was right on something. You'll see a clip of that at the end because it's not very important. But still, Matt, you should be thanking the gods that Ian Miles Chung is just... Just fucking worse than you. I don't even think you would get someone swatted. Like, I just... I just don't think you'd fucking stoop that low. Uh, Gimpy Troll says Ian is a doxer. He was exposed on the kill stream. Ian, do you want to talk about you being a doxer? And oh, being yeah, sure. Yeah, let's, uh, let's talk about me being a doxer. Yeah, I doxed the guy and don't feel bad about it. You know, whatever I said on kill stream, you know, fuck that. They what? basically forced me into a hard position where I was supposed to apologize for doxing a doxer. Like the guy I supposedly doxed, right? It wasn't my dox, it was given to me and I gave it to somebody else who I thought I could trust, but not really, you know. That shit, right? That shit, and people were all like kneeling me into doxy, into doxy. What about the fact that, you know, uh, on Rel's stream, they got a, they got people who dox people actively, have a lot of fun with it, right? And no one goes after them. Like, oh, no one goes after this dude that I, that I doxed, right? Because that's what you do when you're given personal information about someone. You just pass it on, you know, it's, it's sort of a dox. Not really. Oh, but look, over on the kill stream, they dox people all the time, which I haven't actually seen Zidane, Gator, or Ralph dox anyone for reference. Like, if they have, link it to me, but never seen anything like that. But it gets worse. He's not fucking sorry whatsoever. Honestly, this guy is a fucking psychopath. And throughout this video, you're going to be seeing, obviously, tweets from Andy as this is what Ian is trying to do to this guy. Like, just a note, I like Andy. I've been following him for a very long time. Yes, he's had his ups and downs, but I honestly think he's a very nice guy. And yet this scumbag is stealing from him, trying to get him fucking swatted, you know, changing his fucking uh, thumbnails to gay porn, which I know Andy said it, but I'm going to say it as well. Why gay porn, dude? Yeah, porn does the same thing. So, really, it's just... And Andy, this was just video one of Andy. And now Andy is out, like, four grand or so. Doesn't know if he can pay his rent. Doesn't know if he can pay his car payments. It's just it's just psychotic what this fucker is doing to Andy. And has done to other people as well. He, he docks all the game journalists in Gamergate. Like, at that time, he docks all of them. And, and what, I, f I have to feel bad about it? I have to apologize for doxing a guy who doxes people? And then, you know, he comes up with this dumbass story about how uh, he got swatted because I doxed him, how his dog died. And, and all these fucking retards, right? These fucking stupid fucking retards. They, they listen to him and they, like, start attacking me. Like, Ian, how could you get a guy swatted? And they actually believe that meme. So fucking stupid. <laughs> Oh yeah, it's just a meme. It's not like you've- it's been proven that you've done this at all. Nah, it's just a meme. They're just fucking idiots. Yeah, I'm very angry in this video because, you know, I, I, I get a little touchy when people get a dog killed for no reason and then just don't give a shit whatsoever. Plus, obviously, someone else could have got killed as well. When you swatted Andy, it's just like you lived in Canada and the police are obviously nicer than they are in America. They didn't freaking bang his door down and fucking shoot him or something. And, you know, you've DDoSed him as well. You know, stolen his fucking money, lied a bunch. Check your fucking self. That is my response to them. Yeah. Somebody just left. Who just left? An outrage. I have no idea. Nasser. Nasser just left pissed off at Ian. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I, now, let me pause it at 20741. This is another thing you can't respect. Somebody, somebody goes on, made a big deal on, on our show, The Kill Stream, saying, oh, I'm sorry, I wouldn't do it again. Apologize to Goose to his fucking face. Well, you know, it's as close as you can get on the internet. And then, I guess this was maybe a couple months later. I think this was December, so maybe like six, seven weeks later. Oh, I didn't mean any of that. Fuck that. Those guys are full of shit. And, of course, he's he's he kind of talks shit about Jim in this clip, too. And Andy talked about this on his video, that he... He just really, he really hates Jim. He really hates me going back years because we made fun of him. Yeah, apparently Andy said that this just pinnacle of a man would cry repeatedly when Jim would make fun of him. It's just, he's not a beta whatsoever. It's a beta male. Beta. Not an alpha male. Beta male. Yes. Beta male. Beta. You're a beta male. You're a beta male. Not an alpha male. And this type of guy, you criticize him slightly, he tries to ruin your fucking life. Because 
yeah, I don't know what's going through this guy's head. I really didn't know about this guy until this situation happened. I'm pretty disappointed with a lot of people. Why have we just let this guy just slide under the radar for such a long amount of time? <laughs> like, yeah, I I've called out Monday Matt multiple times in recent videos, but Matt isn't as bad as this fucker. And I honestly, Ian, I hope you get fucking nailed to the wall by Andy and he laughs as your all your channels and your career on YouTube just burns to the fucking ground. You psychotic prick. I'm just fired up, man. I'm just fired um, up. I'm tired of, like, you know, apologizing for shit I don't feel bad about. You know what? Fuck that. In, in, on behalf of everybody in the chat, uh, thank you. What a shame. Mom beats boy. As a beta male. Beta. Not an alpha male. Beta male. Yes. Beta male. Beta. You a beta male? You're a beta male. Not an alpha male. Beta. Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Mike is getting upset. He does not like the F word. Uh, he doesn't. I'm so sorry. I apologize. Yeah, Mike gets. Mike's like, look. What I feel bad about. Like, I actually. Not, really not my channel. It. Not my channel. Yeah, it's my channel. I'm gonna get in trouble. I'll get in big trouble for all the F words. Uh, yeah. I'm, sure gonna, I'm sure somebody's gonna. I'm sure somebody's gonna. You know, cap that and say, oh, Ian yeah. doesn't feel bad about doxing people." Yeah. Okay. So what? I don't care. why I care about potentially ruining someone's life. I'm guessing you don't care about swatting people either, as you know, you got a dog killed and you really don't seem to be that phased about that. You actually laughed about it three months ago on the stream, which is, yeah, it's, it's just getting to the point where you're like, what the hell is wrong with this guy? And you know, I hope Andy actually contacts the police in your country, since apparently you're not allowed to own gay porn. I personally think you should be able to, but it seems like you're breaking the law in your country, mate. Maybe, you know, maybe they should check it out. As Andy said, I think you should be, you know, chucking a couple of your hard drives in the fucking microwave, man. As you obviously don't seem to give a shit who you hurt, so, you know, Andy's just following the laws of your country. Why are you breaking them? You know, maybe you should think about that before you try and absolutely destroy someone. Like, literally, Andy's out of, like, four grand. And, like, Andy's really, was well, sort of redemption arc lately. Like, he trained for three months to fight. He actually went. Tonka, obviously, everyone knows. He completely bitched out. Didn't get paid for that. Didn't get paid for this. So, you know, well, yeah. Well, who cares if Andy's homeless? I don't even think I know that. I did have an article pulled up where he falsely accuses a man of rape. Little Hitler, that was our old name for him. Because uh, as much as he hates Nazis and, and uh, quote unquote hates Nazis nowadays, he used to, you know, he used to talk about how he fucking loved Hitler and, you know, gassed the Jews and all that stuff. Uh, here he is falsely accusing a man of rape uh, late 2014. There's all kinds of stuff on this dude. Why Reddit banned influential moderator Ian Miles Chong? Why did they ban him? Because he was selling influence on Reddit. People were paying him to promote their content because he was a big Redditor and he had all this whatever the fuck they call it over there. I don't know. Is it karma? Oh, or what? God. I, I Seriously, pay Ian Miles Chungalunga $1 and he'll suck your dick. Pay him $2 and I'll let you do him up the fucking ass. Though, it looks like, you know, he's freaking an abortion that's been thrown against a wall, so... Don't know if you'd really want to do that, but hey, if you're gay, maybe just chuck a bag over his head or something. It's two bucks, so it's probably the cheapest prostitute on the planet. <sighs> Ian had no remorse for this either. He laughed. He laughed, and as you heard the clip earlier, when Goose said that, he he laughed. I think he he got some sick deviant thrill off knowing that he had a canine killed by his own actions. What kind of man is this? Not a man at all. Ugh. Fucking snake. A an eel. <laughs> an eel. <laughs> Fucking slimy piece of shit. Oh my god. I don't even know. Anyway, turn this video off. I just want to say Zidane is the only one that really called him out three months ago. Great job, mate. And let's just watch a quick clip of, because I'm not going to play his entire video because I don't want you all to fall asleep, of Monday Matt actually being right about this guy to some degree. Out of all the people that were surrounding him, were being uh, he was attacking for nine months, Monday and fucking Matt is the only one that's right. What, what universe are we in? This is just fucking nuts. Maybe this was at a time when Monday Matt wasn't an absolute prick. 
I don't know. It's funny that Matt's basically turned into a lesser version of this guy. But still, for this particular video, he was right. However, his apology is something that I have a few issues with. And I just want to start by saying no one is perfect by any stretch of the imagination. Everyone makes mistakes. But when it comes to Ian, I'm a little bit more critical than others in this particular regard. Sargon says, give the guy a shot. Let's see if, you know, he can, if he actually is apologetic. Uh, I say it should be taken with a much larger grain of salt. Well, Sargon was completely wrong. You are actually right in this point, Matt. And four years later, we now know definitively that Ian Miles Chung is one of the scummiest people online. I honestly hope that you you just just cry into obscurity as any Andy bitch fucks your ass, you fucking scumbag. And I know I, I've been really pissed off in this video. Probably a shit video. I don't really care. I've watched that freaking video of the dog being flashbanged like four times while making this. It's really, really pissed me off. The only thing that's getting me from just just screaming for 20 minutes completely is that Kingdom Hearts 3 is fucking awesome. If you like Kingdom Hearts, Kingdom Hearts 3 is amazing. I, th I was hoping they were going to fuck it up. They didn't. Combat's fucking great. Graphics are incredible. Storyline's really good so far. Do yourself a favor. Go buy it. Anyway, guys, let me know what you think in the comment section down below. Do you think Ian is worse than Matt? Do you think Mass Matt is worse than Ian? I'd really like to know. Anyway, uh, I've got another video coming up as, guess what? Queer Kid Stuff is promoting Islam to children. This is just going to be, you know, I'm not going to go completely insane whatsoever. That's a great idea, isn't it? Anyway, fuck it. See you later, guys. It's official black. I'm the gay dirt dick love. Pussy boy, a.k.a. the turd dick love.